What's up, Eminem? It's your girl, Maya. And your boy, Malik. I'm back with another video. Okay, guys. So, today, we're going to be unboxing all, well, unboxing all the stuff we've gotten so far. The Baby K. Alright, this is the baby bag we got. I got this off and Walmart.com or Amazon. Either one, I can't remember. But I'll tag where I got it from in the description. Oh. Honestly, not gonna lie, I'm kinda disappointed with this diaper bag because I thought it was gonna I thought it was a little bit bigger than it actually is, like more spacious in the inside. Cream soda. I thought like it's not as spacious as I thought it was gonna be, you know? <clears throat> I don't know. I don't, this might not end up working out for us, but we'll see. Cause it doesn't. It's not that spacious. So, and this we got these from Walmart. Um, they're just like some little newborn sockies, which is like essential for your baby to have, especially because we have a winter baby. We never had a winter baby. All our babies were born like when it was warm outside. So it's gonna be different because all our babies were born when it was warm out. I got somebody that can relate to me now. And this time it's gonna be like it could be like snowing when she comes here. It so. will be snowing. <laughs> I mean, like, that's I'm like, saying, that like, same day. I'm just saying, like, you know, because yeah. we haven't had snow this whole year, so. Yeah, so Everywhere it's probably going to be snowing when she get here. So we definitely going to make sure she extra warm with some socks. Yeah. Oh, we got this from Jewel. We got some all-purpose wipes. Jewel's is high. I don't recommend going to Jewel's. <laughs> Oh we went gosh. to Jewel, bro. I'm like, I should be in Walmart right now because everything like three dollars more, like for every single item. And they have the exact. Let me tell y'all. The exact same. It might be a different store. You might think you're getting the best, better option, but it's the exact same stuff. Yeah, I'm just like that's how. I, but that's how I feel about Target. Like I know the Target has like a nice atmosphere, but I'm just not made for Target. Like I'm just a Walmart bitch, and I just, just. Now, if you're getting food, go to the better places. But for like just regular household things, Walmart. Like Walmart is definitely the cheapest. Like period. But oh look, this had a coupon in it. She didn't even use it. She was too busy. $1 she was too busy all up in my business. Yeah, we could have saved it all on these. Whatever. Um These are the only pacifiers our kids ever took, so Yeah, even though they really didn't take pacifiers that long. So I yeah. just got these ones. These ones are three months plus, but I did order some other three month pacifiers too. So we'll see if she even likes it. I guess our kids are bougie. They get that from Maya. Um <laughs> I'm waiting on you to say something smart, but you didn't say nothing. We just got, we both got body wash. The one is for nighttime wash, and this one's for just regular wash. Some, some skin. Yeah, and this is just Dove Baby. I love some Doves. But we're not going to actually put these in the diaper bag. But I actually did, oh, I left them on the table. I bought some of those refillable tubes um, like that cost like, a, like the empty bottles, and I'm probably going to end up packing them with some of these, and then we can actually put them in the diaper bag. So she can have some like soap for when she stays with grandma. Yeah, back hurt. <laughs> yeah, back hurt soon. Hooping. Well, um, we got some Andy ointment. If you're having a baby, Andy ointment. You need it. But make sure you're changing that pamper so they don't get that. Yes. Pain. But sometimes it's inevitable because they could just be allergic to the diapers that you choose. And sometimes they pee overnight. You yeah. don't know. So, Andy ointment. But, and, and, but this is the preventive one. This is to prevent getting the diaper rash. And they also have one that like to heal diaper rashes. Why we, why we get both? Cause our, I mean, our kids have never really had problems with diaper rashes. Yeah. But at the end, but so like we have never had that problem because we be on it, especially when they that little like no. Man, anyways, this thing like let me tell y'all. I know we have a two year old. You be like y'all should be used to this. This feels brand new. No, literally, like I was like, how do we even have a new baby? Again? Like we are not like we are not prepared. No, not at I'm all. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. We are not prepared at all. It's like everything is so last minute. But with, mm -hmm. uh, with the other kids, you was like, we had shit. I mean, we had stuff. Like, like a lot. Like five months in advance. No, now, literally. Now it's the last month, and we're like, okay, let's. Literally, let's we're in like it. the last twenty something days. And then we just got some boogie wipes just to wipe their nose, her nose. She's gonna be born in the winter, so I don't know. I don't, maybe we have one of those sometimes. So we got some bo unscented boogie wipes. We put in the trash. That's over there. Yeah, Alright, we got some. Damn, are they over here? Oh, bitch. I don't know. I ain't really that big, but we got bottles. And we, got, we decided, well, I decided. <laughs> I'm gonna go with the. Even though I'm gonna, I'm gonna breastfeed. 
um and she probably won't end up using bottles too much especially like for the first couple months because i'm not going to be working and i'm just going to be exclusively feeding her i might sometimes like if i'm going somewhere like get my nails done or something I'll obviously i have to pump so malik can feed her we got the tommy tippy ones which is just, a big problem with us too because after they breastfeed they don't want to take bottles especially kamora kamora capri took bottles though. i often say i often say one of our kids took bottles capri and kicks kicks took bottles too long we okay to, like, it was just kamora, just kamora. i can you know i can't remember right now because that was so if it, that was so long Ago, right? Yeah, like, our our baby girl, like literally, when she turned about five months, she just would not take a bottle no more. And I, I couldn't do anything. I literally used to, as I worked really close to home, so I would just like drive home on my breaks and like feed her and then like go back to work. And Malik would just give her like baby food and stuff in the meantime, in between time. But yeah, we decided to go with the Tommy Tippy bottles. I've used the Dr. Browns before in the past, and I just didn't really like them that much. So yeah, we're gonna go with the Tommy Tippy ones this time. And yeah, we're gonna put this in her diaper bag. Just in case, you know, and you know, I want Daddy to feed her for I can go get my lashes done. Hurry it. These are Walmart. And these are just some little mittens. Which some, my kids never even kept these on half the time, but like otherwise they'll scratch up their face. So I try to make sure they keep their mittens on. Oh, no, that was Capri. Kingston. Kingston. Yeah, Kingston. I know yeah. Capri scratched his face up too. But Capri with Kingston. Remember Kingston had like his head was oh, bleeding because yeah, yeah. he was, was yes. scratched, like he was literally scratched his head so much that it would bleed. And he just being a smile. And he was just. Now he, now he cry all day. But yeah, so we got some little mitties. Little mitties. And I just, I just got this today from Dollar General. It's a little boy one technically, but it's okay because I'm just not going to use like the little package that it comes in. I have some other ones. But it's just like a little grooming kit. It comes with um, a little spray bottle, which I don't know what the heck we would put in that spray bottle, but okay. It comes with a little spray bottle, a little comb, a brush. A little tongue cleaner, which is really important. Make sure you guys are cleaning your baby's tongues. They're not going to have teeth, but you still need to be cleaning their mouth out. Oral care. Yeah, oral care is very important. So it comes with a little toothbrush and a little tongue finger tongue scrubber. Um, and then some little nail clips. Oh. Obviously. We got a little pack of newborn diapers. And I'm going to take as many from the hospital as I can. So we just we've only got like a little bit at home right now. And then these are the ones I was talking about, the zero to three month passies. Because we got both. I don't really know. I'm not really sure what much what the big difference is. Mm. Oh, I guess the, the nipple that they suck on they look the same. is bigger. One's bigger. Look. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, zero to three. I don't see it. Look. I don't see that much. Oh, there's not that much of a difference, but these would say zero to three. So these are the ones we're going to start off with. Um, Infant birth cloth. You know, you don't want to throw up on your clothes. You might just, you know, hand you the baby, got a new Nike shirt on. You want to mess up your Nike shirt? <laughs> I don't think so. No. No, can't mess up the Nike shirt. Okay, let's see what's the next one. So this is from Amazon. Okay, so, oh, this is the pack of just regular, plain, newborn onesies. Uh, there's like 15 in here. I think I got, this is a pretty good deal. I think I got yeah. Those are like six. It better be 15. It would be like 15. Or no, not 15, eight. There's eight in here for $15. That's what it was. I'm um, saying, I don't know, I know 15. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, there's eight. Okay, so yeah, there's eight little onesies. Just little plain white onesies to go into all her little the, the baby light, though. sleepers. Baby white tees. No, literally, baby white tees. And you go, these are essential, which I'm going to wash all this stuff with the little um, baby sh shampoo. But for right now, we're just opening this stuff literally right now. So, yeah, we've got baby onesies, essential. <laughs> just a little tattoo. Bro. Then in this little bag right here, we got just some little outfits. They're going to put in her diaper bag. Oh, my God. She's ready. Bro, are you ready for this? Oh, my God. Somebody's gonna be this freaking. Tell me, you ready for this? I don't even know how she looks. Oh my god! The duh, nigga, what the fuck? I mean, I can't say. Oh my god, she's gonna oh, be so cute. Look, she might come out looking like you. <laughs> stop playing with me. Look, look. Bro, if you don't stop playing. <laughs> no, I'm actually, guys, like I'm. Oh like, my god! <laughs> Hair. <laughs> I like these ones because they have the little um in mittens that are come with it you know that way you don't have to wear mittens because these automatically will cover her hands yeah okay and they should be okay they actually oh, smell these 
Mm. It's like a baby, a newborn baby is already in it. <laughs> right, doesn't it? You smell good. What's that? Two more onesies. Are those come from Walmart? I ain't gonna lie, this combination of pink and blue is It's so cute. Hey, these ones came point. from Walmart. Look at this. Pink and blue. Oh. Look at the donuts. These are so cute. And then, if I can give you a Nike shirt with white, pink, and blue like that, I would rock it. Yeah. Find a dog today. Y'all can look cute together. Only, you guys, the only thing I don't like about Walmart onesies is their sleeves are, like, so short. Like, you see how short these sleeves are? Like, don't they look super short? Yeah. Very close. Um, yeah. Compared to the other ones. She have a good point. You see, like, why are they so a short? Very good point. I like blue. I'm a fan of blue. So, we have the little cupcakes on them. You know? A little simple. I do say you know a lot. I would definitely say you know. <laughs> uh, we already showed this one. And little clouds. I think that's supposed to be clouds. You know, kindergarten clouds. I'm, I only got, what was that? I think eight newborn outfits because they really don't be a newborn for that long. So I didn't, my mom already told me that she had got us a couple too. So I was like, I'm not going to get no more newborn outfits other than those. We have the meat. Uh -oh. Okay. So I got these. That looks like a food. For both of us. I got these off Amazon. That's not all of them. I think I'm only going to put like two in her bag, but I got How these. How many is it? Uh, I can't remember. I got you. We have one. Two, three, four, five, six, I believe. So I'm gonna put everything that came out of this little group. I don't know, I'm gonna figure out which one to tie this tie this side to begin. And then I'll put all the stuff out the grooming dip kit, like the A and D ointment, like extra pacifier, like little just essentials. Just so her diaper bag is just like more neat. I'm gonna put stuff in here and then also I'm gonna keep some for me for you know just to have like for under my sink or my makeup or whatever. Just a little snuggle less snug. Just some more socks. Some more snuggle. More little sockies. I think it's so weird how they do too many sockies. I think it's weird how they do like zero to six months. Like that's such a big gap. I think if I thought it should be like zero to three. Because a six month old foot versus a newborn foot is like very much different. What's in here? Okay, so we can't show you guys everything here. Why? Um, so I can show oh, you like the back. I can show the you the back name. of it. I can show you the back of it, but this little thing has her name on it, so I'm not gonna show you. But um, right, show the hat. It's like a little hat, and then it has her name on it on the front and back. Guess the name. And then win twenty five dollars. This is her name on both sides. Of course, her name's on both sides, but I'll show you just this part. It's just like a little K, and then her name's underneath it. And we're probably just gonna take her first little pictures, like wrapped up in this. I'm happy we got four kids now. It's not KKK no more. It's KKK, K, 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 K. Yeah, because now it's like we the KKK killers. Yeah, that's exactly what we were going for. Yeah, you, 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 that's, that's all we had out of mind. Kill, cool, cuss, plan. Yeah. If you're with it, you're with it. If you ain't with it, get with it. So, yeah. That's what we're going to wrap her in. Yeah. And that is her. That's cute. Ooh, yay. Ooh, yeah. Smoke daddy. Smoke. This is her. Please don't put my baby shit on your dirty ass head. Thank you. Nope. This is my mama. Yeah, she's gonna see that. Um, <laughs> this is what we put over her little um car seat. It's a little car seat cover. I think it's super cute. My mama said it. My mama, I feel like this is to play peekaboo. My mama said it wasn't cute, but I'm like, girl, you ain't cute. This is to play peekaboo with your cute. child. Just look at this. I'm like, don't put it on your head. It's a car seat cover. It ain't no, gonna touch her. your hair is dirty and it's white no, it's in not. there. I just don't don't put it on your head, Blake, bro. Bro. See. 
Look. No, for real. Take it off. That. Take it off. <laughs> like, don't piss me off right now. For real. Ooh, I'm shaking it, my boots. Look, you got your dirty ass pubic hair on it. <sighs> okay, so this is super cute. And then, you know, just opens up so you can be like. I like the fact that it opens up like this, like twice, like a little net. So, like, y'all not touching my baby. And then it opens up like this, and like mommy and or daddy needs to get in there and help her out. Fix your face and don't put my baby shit on your fucking dirty ass head. But yeah, it's a little car seat cover. Do your thing. Girl's going wild. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Bro, you about to be a bitch. Hey y'all, it's, it's been a long journey. Look at my hair. I don't know if it shook, it felt kind of stale. But, oh. <laughs> But um, they shape, bro. I ain't gonna lie, they shape. I think that is literally it. That's all the stuff that we've gotten. Oh, uh, also, we do have. Can you get those towels right there? Those are corny shit. So we just have. A sweet life was. What, the what's though. these? These are uh, hanky. <laughs> They're just these towels. just little yeah just little face towels. Cause, hanky. How's a hanky? What's a hanky? <laughs> Let's like, what do people use to wipe their like snot? And, you know, like. A hanky. A handkerchief, you know, it goes in your pocket like as a man. Use that as a man. That's a handkerchief. A hanky is a hank is that like the short it's a thing? Hank a hanky is a handkerchief for babies. Hanky? It sounds cute. Okay. <laughs> like, oh go get the hanky. You know? <laughs> no, that doesn't fucking sound cute. Okay, either Y'all get it, right? Somebody said yes. <laughs> <laughs> Ow. My legs are Okay, so yeah, anyways, we just got a, we just got a couple little towels, and then we did get her a dry towel. Next day, but her towels came, so I'm gonna wash these up and put them in the diaper bag, too. Um, but it's not gonna be here till tomorrow, I think Amazon said. Tomorrow, so we're just gonna put these in her diaper bag, so that way when she has her first little bath at the hospital, it's not with them rough, you know they be using them rough-ass towels on newborns? Oh my like, when I, when I, my first baby, I didn't know that I should, like, bring towels. Cause I just didn't know that. And I'm like, y'all finna wash my baby up with that rough ass towel that probably been on somebody coochie. But yeah, so we gonna make sure she has her own towels and her own dry towel for when she has her first bath in the hospital. We have this tote and it's just, I actually found these. These were all Kimura's blankets. So it's just I already washed all these. So it's just full of a bunch of like comfy warm blankets like go over her in the car seat. I couldn't find any receiving blankets anymore, so that's another thing that we have to make sure we have. I know they give you one in the hospital, but, you know, we want to have a bunch more at home. So we just need to ha get some more receiving blankets. But she has a bunch of little fluffy, warm blankets already. I forgot to mention during the video is that I live by these gallon freezer bags for my kids. Like, for my older kids, too. Like, when we go anywhere, like, packing their suitcase. I love packing their clothes, like, down to the socks and underwear each in a gallon freezer bag like all separated that way once they're done with the outfit i can just put it right back in that same bag and that way it just keeps their suitcase or diaper bag like super organized so definitely once i wash up all her little outfits i'm gonna have like her little onesie her little sleeper a pair of mittens and socks all in one little freezer bag and then that way her diaper bag can just stay like super organized. And that way if we go somewhere and she has like a blowout or she spits up on her clothes, I can just put all the dirty clothes right back inside of that freezer bag and that way it won't get anything else in the bag dirty. But yeah, just to like a little tip that like I use when packing my kids' bags that has been really helpful for us. But I think that's it. Is that it, big dog? Decisions, decisions. I think yes. that's it. That's it. That's it. So that's all for her today's video. And we didn't actually pack the diaper bag because I need to like wash everything and like unpackage the stuff. And I'm not about to be on here for an hour doing that. So, anyways, that's everything that's going to be in our baby's diaper bag. Make sure you guys give this video a big thumbs up. Make sure you comment Malik Super Annoying. And also, uh, subscribe. I don't to think I should come back. <laughs> also, that's subscribe it. to our channel. We love you. And Oh, but y'all the ones that been wanting to know how my tattoo looks. First off, no. look at this. Look, look. look. Oh, I've been wanting to show this. I don't think I ever showed y'all. But hey, look. Y'all don't want to see mine. So, yeah. You know, tattoo dude here in Rockford. You know, if you want the details, just let me you know. know. You know. You know. So comment like, ooh, where you get your tattoo from? I got you. Okay. Bye.